All right, so in today's video, we're going to talk about how to set up the Mycroft Android app uh, on your phone and then on your watch if you have an Android 2.0 smartware watch. I haven't tried it with anything other than that because that's all I have right now. Um, the easiest way I found to do this without having to really download Android Studio or anything like that, use this link. I'll put it in the description. It basically is the APK or the app file already that Seymour has written. Uh, that's that's maintaining this package or this project. So you want to download this, which I've already done. And so now, if I open up my file manager in my downloads, you'll notice I have uh, somewhere in here the Mycroft. Uh, where is it? Right here. All right, Mycroft Android Snapshot APK, right? So what I've done is I've already plugged up my phone. So uh, I need to unlock it though and allow inside of it, I'm gonna get a prompt saying, you know, do you wanna access, allow access to your phone data? So I'm gonna hit allow on that. And now you'll see that my phone shows up. Uh, if you're on Linux, you don't really have to do anything special. This just kind of works out of the box. If you're on Windows, you might need to install the OEM drivers or something. I'll put the link to, uh, this list of where you can get all those for the different versions or for the different manufacturers. So now when I click on my Android, I'll go into phone and now I have this listing right of everything in my phone. So what I'm gonna do is just go to download and you can see I haven't put it in here yet, right? So what I'm going to do is just open up a new one of these and go to my downloads and copy this and just throw it in here, right? So I'm just gonna throw in that one APK file into my phone. And so now uh, you're gonna, I'm gonna transfer over to the, uh, f to the device with a recording and we're going to then see how uh, you can actually install the app from there, so. All right, so here you can see I'm opening my files. Now I'm going to the installation files for the APK and going to the download and then running that. Then it's wanting me to go to settings and, un and allow unknown, so unknown sources, which I do for just this one installation. And now it's gonna do the install. Then I'm gonna open the install and go into the settings and change the IP address to be my local IP address of my Mycroft instance. This one's running on my desktop, but it could be a Mark one, Pycroft, whatever at that point. Now I'm actually going to try to you know show you how you can do the recording piece, right? So. You can see here I'm asking it a question. Uh, what you know? What time is it, for example? And then it's going to give me back that time. And then if I ask it, uh, you know, what is the weather for today? Then I'm going to get that back as well, which you're going to see here. And so that's how that piece works. Um, if you have any questions or concerns, uh, please join the Mycroft community. Uh, I'll have some other videos coming out soon with more specifics around how all this stuff works. But uh, hopefully this will be a good tutorial and go from there. Thanks. Have a good day. Bye.